The United States Savings Bonds and the Mutual Network present Bands for Bonds. Hey, yo, yo, yo. Slick, I said to the dad, blame boss, fellas. Be for me. Oh, yeah. Rattle your spurs, boys, and swing your rope high. Go to him and we by and by. Hey, F3, that's Tex Fletcher, old Tex, and the cowboys with him. Lou Apparata, Gabe Drake. We got a special guest, too, old Montana Slim. Yeah, yeah. Got another Western roundup of old songs, old stories, and, of course, old Tex Fletcher. Man, he's real old. <laughs> so, well, next 15 minutes, you better try and sit back, relax, and enjoy some good old Western music. Come on, what's the hoedown? All right, Dan McCullough. Thank you, partner. Here I am. Well, hello, Dan. Glad to see you, Tex. I haven't seen you since, uh, I don't know, I've been about two years. Watch it, Dan, watch it. Tex, them a few words. You bet your life. I heard what he said. It ain't so. No, it ain't. You're not that old. No. Yeah? No. No. Look at them eyes. Dan McCullough wants to know something, partner. Yeah? There used to be a fellow on this ranch named Bob Poole. Uh Uh-huh. Uh-huh, but you notice he ain't here. Yeah, I heard something one day that sounded like this. (laughs) That's it. You guessed, that was the end of pool. You guessed it. Dan, how are you? Did you meet Montana Slim? I met Montana. He's our guest artist. I'm awful glad to see him. I'm going to go chat with him in just a minute or two, but I think you kind of want to get started, don't you hear? He's on RCA Victor Records. Excuse me. Is he really? Yes. Louis. That's, that's Lou Apparatus, the accordion. Hi, Lou. Hi, and that's Tom. not Abe Drake. That's Gabe Drake. No, I'm uh, still mad at him. Uh, all right. Not at all. Dan, listen, fella. Yeah. Let's saddle up, huh? All right, Willis. Let's ride the strawberry roan, shall we? Yeah, all right. Okay, Lou, a little rip, fellas. Oh, that strawberry roan. Oh, that strawberry roan. He went up for the east and came down for the west. To stay in the middle, I'm a doing my best. I'm bored of old strawberry roan. I was hanging around town, just spending my time. Out of a job, not making a dime. When a feller stepped up and he said, I suppose, you're a broad busting man by the lips of your clothes. It figures me right, I'm a good one, I claim. Do you happen to have any bad busting cane? He said he's got one and a bad one to buck. A throwing good cowboys, he's had lots of luck. Oh, that strawberry roll. Oh, that strawberry roll. He went up for the east and came down for the west. To stay in his middle, I'm doing my best. I'm bored of old strawberry roll. Come in, Lou. Strawberry Roan was born in the Black Hill of South Dakota, folks. I'd like to tell you a story what he did to me once. Got a gun. Let's do another course and go out, okay? Oh, that strawberry roll. Oh, that strawberry roll. He went up for the east and came down for the west. To stay in this middle, I'm a doing my best. I'm bored of old strawberry roll. Slow down. Yes, sir. Oh, boy. Yeah. You know right now what we're going to do? No. We're going to talk about New Year's resolutions. Are we? Every year, everybody makes them, and just as regularly, we all break them, don't we? That's right, Dan. Take saving money, for instance. How many times have you said to yourself, boy, next year I'm going to sock away a little something every payday? Haven't you said that, Tex? Yes, I have, Dan. And how often have you kept that? Not too often, son. Well, I'll tell you, one of the best ways and in a sense, most painless way to do this is to get on that famous payroll savings plan. You know how that works, Tex? Well, I think I understand a little bit about it, partner. You know, you're, uh... I got down 23rd floor once... That's right. Too down to the old corral where the boss man is? Yeah. <laughs> That's right. Well, it's very good. It kind of hurts the first couple of weeks, but you get used to it. They take out savings before you get a chance to spend them for something else. Your company, in other words, can set aside whatever amount you name. He puts it into United States savings bonds, and once you've signed up, there's nothing more to it. Right. You just, at the end of the time, you can take your bonds and you can use them for an education for your children or anything else you want. Gee, that's wonderful. That's the payroll savings plan. Go and talk some more about bonds a little later in the show, but let's kind of move back now into the music department. Uh, man, you're going Spanish here. No, something fancy. Is that right? That fellow Lou Apretti, you know, he reads music. You mean he's been south of the border? He has, yeah. yeah. Well, he's let's got something special for us, See what he's got cooked up. Oh, ah. <laughs>
Before, you, yeah. before you take the microphone over, I just yeah. want to remind the folks that I'll be back on the air at 5.55 New York time on the Bobby Benson B. Bar B. Show. Hey, that's good news, Tex. Yeah, I'm Slim Fletcher, the singing cowboy, you know. I know that. I saw you over there. Sure. Over, yeah. Listen, New York time, 5.55. That's good addition to the show. I'm glad you're coming back. Thank you. Coming back? I've been there for six months, son. Where you been? Well, you just said you were coming back. No, I said uh, on the air today. Oh, well, no. 5.55. You've been away for a few weeks? New York... <laughs> Montana Slim, come up here. You come said up here. you're coming back. That's for your exact words. Today. I thought you'd been away somewhere. No, I've been right here, Dan. Have you? Yeah. So you're going to be back today? Mm-hmm. 5.55. New York time. What Mutual network? network? Mutual network. Oh. Okay. I still, don't, I still don't think you're that old, Tex. No, I'm not, Gabe. Look at them eyes. Look, fellas, I'm only 27 years old. Let's get this thing settled. Looks to me like you've got a love knot in your florist. My what? Come here. Montana Slim, I wouldn't stand for that. Come up here. I wouldn't stand for that. Montana, Talk to him. what's cooking? Oh, nothing but uh, love not malaria yet. That's about all. Is that what it is? That's what they tell me. Well, we're awful glad that you're here and going to do this pH to resist stone. Oh, am I really what? glad to be back here? What was that, son? I don't know what it was. Sounds something like I heard in the Army once, overseas, over in Italy. <laughs> Fell out of my mouth. What was that big last word you just said? I'd rather not repeat it. I'd rather hear old Montana Slim Thanks. do it. All right, he says, we'll hey, 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 Tex. He yeah. says old Montana Slim. That's oh, high pocket I, Slim, I, that I is. Have, <laughs> oh, yeah, you're the guy that named me high pocket, aren't you? <laughs> Hello, everybody. Yeah, you know, I'd love to sing that old favorite... Uh, Oh, yeah, yours too? You bet it is, and it's my favorite too. Roll hey, beans, yeah. Oh, no. There's a love knot in my Larry And it's waiting for the blue eyed gal you bet. While I'm riding green all day, my old ass who seems to say, it winds around on wrist parade. Oh, there's a love knot in my Larry and it's waiting for that little prairie pen. When I swim the old land through, you'll hear me through a love knot in my Larry Slim, thank you for coming, partner. Dan, you want to say something? Oh, no, I just going to say I really enjoyed hearing Montana Slim do that, young Montana Good. Slim. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Say, how about Gabe Drake coming up here? I think he's got something for us. But say, Gabe, I'll tell you what we'll do, son. Uh, we've had a request for Down in the Valley, so let's do one verse of Down in the Valley, and then supposing you do that beautiful old hymn, special dedication to all our shut-in friends out there in Radio Land, Gabe. The one right in the corner? Yeah, oh, I, I like that. That's really a good one. Uh, and this is in flat E, fellas. Flat E. <laughs> Down in the valley, valley so low, late in the evening, hear the wind blow, hear the wind blow, hear the Thank you, Gabe. Say, Gabe, and I want you to sing this right pretty now, you know, right in the corner. It's a beautiful old hymn. And as I said before, it's a special dedication to all those dear friends of ours, the shut-ins. <laughs> <laughs> 
That's right. And Tex, if they have any favors, they can drop us a line. We'll do them for them, too. I think your doggone good idea. Sure. <laughs> Do not wait until some deed of greatness you may do. Do not wait to shed your light afar. To the many duties ever near you now be true. Right in the corner where you are. Right in the corner where you are. Right in the corner where you are Someone far from harbor you may guide across the bar Right in the corner where you are That's mighty nice, Gabe. And we've got a quick reminder here and we're going to wind things up. You know, friends, if you save only two dollars and a half weekly... You'll accumulate savings bonds worth $1,440 in just 10 years. That can mean a trip abroad for you or a down payment on the home that you've dreamed of. It may start you in business for yourself or send your youngster to college. So remember the payroll savings plan or the bond a month plan where you bank. Either way, it's automatic savings. Thank you, Dan McCullough. So long, folks. We'll see you next week. Same time. Let's go, fellas. Hey, let it go, cowboy. Rally your spurs, man. Let them jingle. Swing your rope. Come in, Dan McCullough. Yeah, friends, you've been listening to Bands for Bonds, which came to you from our mutual studios in New York. Today, we featured Tex Fletcher and his cowboys, who presented the music of this treasury program as one of the public service activities of the American Federation of Musicians, the James C. Petrillo president. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let her rip, boys. This is the mutual broadcasting system. Ah, uh, he said mutual, folks. Let's go, fellas. Ah, la, la. Oh, with a little operetta going to town with Gabe Drake. Fuck that thing, boy. Montana Slim doing a dance. Let her rip, fellas. Yeah, yeah, yeah.